can switch positions, reverse psychology. I don't mean to drive you nuts, think cut, but I keep the business up, keep the haters on us. So every time we touch, we raise it a level up. Come with it, I don't think you're crazy enough. I hear you talking, but I'm calling you bluff. Hope you like it wild and rough. Second time out now, in as many months, how did you find the fight time? Good, uh, please get the rounds in the belt, as I've just been saying here. Uh, I don't want to fight my next fight. Did you fight now in May the 19th? May the 19th, yeah. David Price belt. Yeah. Uh, for the English, yes. by the title. Yeah. Um, are you glad then that you got the six rounds under the belt tonight rather than a quick knockout like you did under the end? Ah, please, yeah, yeah. It's always. I knew it was just far, I knew it was going to go the distance really late, yeah, but I, I, I think I could have upped the pace a little bit more, but. Other than that, I'm pleased I got the rounds under the belt. Yeah, because he seems to be the sort of fighter just there to survive. He doesn't want to win the fight, he just wants to survive. Get the six rounds under your belt. Did you find that awkward? Or did you find, you know... I wasn't, it wasn't a bit awkward. The catch they always are when they don't want to be hit. Like someone who's there to fight back at you is going to be easy to hit, aren't they? Because they're going to be, leave themselves open, whereas he just hides, tucks up and grabs on, yeah, made, made it a little bit awkward, but yeah, I dealt with it all right. Yeah, it's a totally different style to Bob Abishaf as well, isn't it? Well, I've never really seen much on I just have like, I, uh, I know he's, he's, I've been told he's awkward and that's who uh, could be a good warm up fight for him. Right, you can do anything, any relaxing now, you're straight back in the gym ready for the main tonight? I'm straight back in the gym now. Who are you sparring with at the moment before the edges of the fight? Uh, only one, I can get rude. Um, like my brother, I've got the lads down the gym, spar with, the, uh, I like Craig, do a bit spar with Craig Dixon. You don't call any from the outside in? I always want to get, want to get people in. I was, but yeah, I'm not really. Did you watch with Danny Price? Danny Price, I, I, I would, I would like to do it. It's fine with him. I would like to get down. Same way, he's, cru he's cruising. No, he's yeah. down the road. But like, I'm obviously, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to start travelling now. But for that fight there, I've got a lad in the gym here, David Passmore. He's wanting to turn pro, and he boxes. He's, he's like, he's a big, tough lad. So I've been sparring with him. He was good sparring for it. I mean, you're happy now. You've been more active. You had quite a bit of a period out of the ring, didn't you? Yeah, I did. I yeah, with problems and that. Yeah, I still get niggles and that now and then. Me back, but it's not what it was. So what's please be back here. Yeah. What sort of back problems did you? Have? It was two bulging discs. So. Did your physio on it? I had it. Um, I get like I see a physio eye and that you like sort of stretch it. I just have to stretch it every time before I start and just keep on top of it, keep it more, keep it mobilised. I mean, what you're doing now as you progress as a professional. Do you change anything? Do you change your diet, your nutrition, your training? Oh, I eat well all the time now. I like, eat plenty of it, but I eat well. Uh, I feel on top form. Like. Do you like to party when you're finished? Enjoy yourself? Ah, you've got to enjoy yourself, haven't you? You've got to have a couple of days. But okay. then straight back to business. Alright, alright. Is that right for you? Brilliant. Yeah. Oh, damn, I'll do my own. Let's wait for a pint. <laughs> Switch positions, reverse psychology. I don't mean to drive you nuts, think cut, but I keep the business up, keep the haters on us. So every time we touch, we raise it a level up. Come with it, I don't think you're crazy enough. I hear you talking, but I'm calling you bluff. Hope you like it wild and rough.